Hello, hello and welcome back. This is episode 90 fucking 3 of my blind let's play of Dark Souls 3. I'm in the Cathedral of the Deep because somebody told me that there's a way to respect my character here. So I'm back here because I'm getting my ass whooped by the Soul of Cinder boss and uh, I put way too many fucking points into Vitality and the armor that it allowed me to equip by doing that just really has not been helping me. So I want to respec. Somebody told me it's here that I do it. I got betrayed by an onion motherfucker that lowered a bridge that I don't even know how it got raised. But it's the one bridge that I need to fucking cross in order to get to some fucking treasure area in this place that I've never been to way up on the top level. And I'm just assuming and guessing that that's... Also, where the fucking respecking place is gonna be, because that's the place that's here that I haven't been. So let's let's go with that. And oh shit! Oh, the fucking giant is still shooting the arrows out here. And the other place that the giant was shooting the arrows was the undead settlement. And that's where it was shooting the, the arrows from, from the tower of the Undead Settlement. Can I see that from here? Doesn't look like it. Oh shit, it's hitting the tree. And I thought, didn't I go up and talk to that giant or something? Oh wait, it's coming from over there. It's just hitting the tree over and over? Okay, I want to take a look at that, but let me get rid of this pile of crap. You're out of touch, I'm out of time, but I'm out of my head when you're not around. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Damn, I sang that pretty good. I wonder what that actually sounds like on the recording. That's the best I've ever fucking sang that. Do not see any onion shaped betrayers down here. You ever notice how the French sound like this, but Germans, they also roll their R's and make their THs sound like these as well as the French. Yeah, the Romance languages, they have so much in common, oui, oui. Uh, je suis Canadien et je peux parler français. Uh, je ne suis pas la meilleure. Je, je ne m'appelle pas francophone, mais uh, je peux parler français. Uh, sprechen Sie Deutsch? Nein. Nein. <laughs> Even though my grandparents are German and my grandpa came from Germany when he was like 12 and he sp speaks German, I do not. He's uh, a man of few words, unless he is tipping back a bottle. And I'm really not a drinker myself, so I haven't spent too much time conversing with that gentleman, unfortunately. He is still alive, which is cool. 80 years old. Uh, anyway. The arrows. No more arrows. The arrows stopped. And that was the first and only other place that I encountered the onion guy was in that tower where that giant was so does is that a connection does is that relevant i have no fucking clue okay down there that's where the crystal lizard was inside those crystals and here's that door that i thought i had opened that i had to reopen uh, like unless i just forgot to fucking open it does that have something to do with the fucking the bridge I mean, I just have no fucking clue. Uh, I guess I'll just, like, take a quick peek back in here. Come at it from this way, see if that makes some kind of difference. Uh, I'm not gonna spend long here, I'm gonna go back outside and explore out there. But, like, yeah, that bridge does nothing for me. That bridge does nothing for me. This bridge... I mean... <laughs> I was about to walk out and just be like, oh, is it invisible now? But no, I mean, we clearly all saw it fucking lower. They give you this doorway for nothing. Is there an invisible bridge here? Hold on. 
Is there an invisible bridge here? Uh, let me try it. <sighs> At least I had enough health to live. God damn. I mean, I want to, like, try lower on the other two bridges, but then... Like, what if that screws something up? I, I don't know. I don't fucking know. The only other idea I have is to, like, just go and check the rest of the outside areas, which is not that many other areas to check. Just to see if this is, like, I'm supposed to, like, go chase down Mr. Onion Douchebag out that door. It's the only other thing I can really think of. Maybe that's why the door closed on its own, because it's supposed to be a thing where... You have to chase him out there. Yeah, I, I don't have enough time to, like, get up onto that. To pull the switch and then get up onto that. There's not enough time. <sighs> this is annoying. Let's go back over here. It, it's so annoying knowing that the area is right fucking there. And I feel like I'm so close to getting over there. And I just don't have the fucking slightest clue what to do right now. So, whatever. I'll just go out there. Hopefully this elevator is at the bottom. Uh, yes it is, right? Yeah. Boom. We'll go out the door. Like, maybe... Uh, Maybe if I hadn't re- maybe it reclosed that door because the onion guy was here now and it wanted me have to have the clue that when I came back up here looking for him after he lowered the bridge on me that this door would be open all of a sudden to show me that he had opened it. And that would give me the clue to look out here for him. And if that's the case, then I've already looked down there. Didn't find him, so it would have to be this way. So let's let's just re-explore this until I make my way back into the cathedral. And if I haven't found him by then. Then I think it's safe to say that I'm probably not gonna find this. the wrong shield on me, so I can't do the shield splitter. Oh, that's kind of neat, though. Maybe shield bash is fucking more, more interesting and useful than I really thought about. Ugh. I have no fucking clue why they give you that shortcut, the elevator to that place. Makes absolutely no sense to me. Like, you have to come through here and get into the cathedral to make your way to that elevator. Why, like, why would you want that as a shortcut? I guess it... Uh, I guess it... Uh... Yeah, yeah, you have to get way beyond here. Like, where you already have other better shortcuts before you even get access to that. So I, I have no fucking clue what that's all about. That area down there, is that where that one leeches? I can't remember. Oh, you fell down. Alright, let's take care of you. No, you, uh, you didn't fall down. Yeah, that was you that fell down. Okay. Okay, let's just let's just explore out here calmly, collectedly. Wish I could remember what the hell is down there. Or fucking see better down there. Uh I'll turn the alarm off on, on my phone before that annoys me. Uh oh. Oh wow. <laughs> I mean that was a decent dodge right there. That was damn decent. That was a damn decent dodge, dang it. Damn it, Debbie, that was a dang decent dodge.
I couldn't even tell. Uh, like, when that guy was about to jump. Like, if I was earlier in the game and not able to easily shield tank it, uh, like, I don't know. I guess you have to run away from it and then you'll be able to see this animation's better. Oh, fuck, I forgot about these guys. Uh oh. Uh oh. Fuck you. Okay, so there's a ladder up one of these, right? I'm definitely gonna check that out. Screw you. Oh god. Okay. That works. Jeez. Ah! Ha uh, ha uh, ha uh, ha uh, Come on. Kiyama. Can't see shit without the damn torch. I thought there was a, a way up. Okay, let's go take care of these. I think there's three guys shooting at you down here. Remember this area being annoying. At least I can one-shot them now. That helps a lot. There's four of them. Oh yeah, this is not a bow and arrow guy. Just a shh. Sword and or a shield and spear prick. Okay, that was a weird camera thing. Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah. Thought I remembered that. Son of a bitch. Another one down there. I think that chain's just for show, yeah. Oh, there's one of the fucking giant mace guys over here, isn't there? Yep. Yeah, so let's just take this slowly and steadily. Why can't I walk onto you? Oh god. Come on, come on. Heal, 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 heal. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck it. Okay. Shut up. Yeah, shut up. Whatever. Okay, yeah, the way to get up is to jump onto one of those things. That's right. So... Let's do that. Let's remember how to do that. That's where I just was, right? Yes. Yes, indeed. Okay, so I go back over here. Right? I swear, I remember getting onto one of those in like a kind of risky fashion. No. Wasn't there a way up onto one of these? I swear, I thought there was a way up onto that higher roof.
Hold on, that's an item. I mean, it's always possible that... Yeah, that's an item. For sure. It's possible that to get to that item, you have to get across that bridge part. Or it's possible that to get across that bridge part, you have to figure something else out up here. Like, maybe I was supposed to chase the onion dude out here. Oh, is that it? Oh, that's the ticket. Oh, please don't fuck this up. Eh. Oh. What a fucking pile of fucking crap. God damn. Let's go make our way back there. God damn, son of a bitch. Uh. I feel like this is a fast way over there. Jeez! Oh, fucking leeches. <laughs> so I guess there was nothing in that area below, like, where I was just on top of. Because clearly I didn't make the jump and I just fucking died from falling in the gap. It, like, I died, like, basically immediately on falling it gave no indication that I could have potentially landed anywhere. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, God. God, you have a lot of fucking health. Alright, let's just fucking take out the bare minimum of enemies. Yeah, the guy behind me is probably awake now, too. Yeah. God damn, man. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Can't fucking use any items either, so... Gotta really... watch myself until I get access to my fucking items again. Yeah. Fuck. Just stand around and do nothing until the... I get my items back. Because I'm pretty sure the one guy down there will explode, and I, I just feel like it wouldn't be that hard to get comboed to death out here. Especially with the arrows coming at me. Oh, excuse me. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, I only ever tried to make that jump onto that, whatever these are called, once before. And I made it the first try. So, I don't think this will be crazy difficult. But, I don't know. I mean, part of me wants to try and just run onto it without even jumping. Let's just take care of these enemies first and then think about it in a minute. Okay, yes, I know you're there. Oh, shit. Okay. Nobody chasing after me? No. Yeah, so getting up on here is definitely something that would be good. Well, let's just try running. Fuck it. Oh! Definitely want to pick those up. Ah, oh, Dude! Oh, uh, let's go again. 
I would try going from the other way to see if it's quicker, but one, I don't remember which elevator leads to like that balcony where I first saw the giant that's uh, near the other end of that rooftop area. And two, I have to get my blood stain. So let's just do this again. Again, 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 again. Let's go. Everybody fuck off and just let me get to where I need to fucking get to. Take care of this fucking prick again with the two fucking swords. Okay, let's take out the guy sitting on the ground right away so that he can't throw that shit at me that stops me from using items. Damn you. Okay. You're an asshole. Give me what you got. Take care of this guy. Nothing, okay. We'll take care of this guy. And we'll run. And we'll take, oh, I'll plunge, hold on. Let's plunge onto this guy. Okay, that didn't work. Okay, that worked. All right. Oh shit! Fucking aggro to fucking imp without uh, even remembering that it was there. Let's not fuck this up. Let's not get killed by these piddly little archers before I get my blood stain, or at all. Die. Okay. It's not that hard. I don't love that the only two fucking options for the jump button are L3 or circle, and that was the same in Dark Souls 2. Because if you do it on circle, then it's overlapping with your run and your dodge button. Like, having run and dodge on the same button already makes things complicated and somewhat restrictive, and then having a third function on there is just like, no. Whereas having it on L3, at least it's its own button, but having it on the same... Uh... You know, having it on the analog stick that you're also using to control the direction of your running is also annoying as fuck. I, I wish that you could have uh, target lock on L3 and then jump on R3. That seems like it would be better. You could fuck up your camera, which I guess that would fuck things up too. I don't know what's the solution. There's got to be a better solution, but whatever. There's imps up here, right? I mean, shit. I, I feel like I'm really grasping at straws here. Grasping at onions, if you will. But, there is an item in there. That tells me something. Well, that, that could just be an area that I'm able to get to when I get to that other balcony from the inside that's across that stupid bridge that I can't lift. Where are you? Let's just do this. <laughs> kind of like that shield bash. Okay, well, let's all agree that we don't see anything else that I can do out here. Yeah, there's that item. Very clearly. So either I get to that out here, or I get to that from somewhere else that leads up there. Possibly the inside. I don't know. That, like, none of this area screams like hidden wall, because it's got all these little fucking things in front of it. Usually it's a wall that you can go through that... 
well, I guess it was that statue the one time, but usually it's like a solid, one solid piece that just disappears. No, nothing out here is screaming progress. So, fuck it. That didn't work. That's good. That's the one I just climbed up, right? Yeah, and that's the guy that was guarding that item. Right, right, right. I mean, we're, we're pretty close to being done fucking exploring abso fucking lootly everything and not not having found it, which is uh, discouraging. Oh, that's not good. He's got his little push. Yeah, halberd. That's the second time today I've gotten a halberd off of you. Oh, what is this? Oh, I forgot about that room. I mean, I doubt it fucking leads to anything, but I did forget about it. Yeah, this is this. This is this. Yes. Yes, I've explored all this very recently. Like, is there a wall over here to poke? I'm, I'm just like, uh, I'm out of my fucking mind. I, I really doubt it, but yeah, I don't like fighting this guy. That's for sure. But do what you gotta do. Oh, no items. Fucking goddamn. No, I will not come to you. Fuck it, shield dash. Gotcha. Shield dash didn't do much to him, but it at least staggered him. Okay, I feel like there's nothing down there. Wait. Wait! Okay. Good thing I came over here. Well, let's go for it. Are you fucking serious? What the fuck, man? What the fuck? Why do they show me an item and then I can't drop down there? Okay, let's go back once again. We're halfway through this episode. We're at 29 minutes. Let's, let's, uh, I mean, that, that is something. That's not nothing. That's absolutely not nothing. The fact that I just noticed a new fucking item lying there. Now I just need to figure out how the hell to get to it. May, like, do you get it from dropping down? Maybe. Maybe I just need to find a part closer to it that actually lands directly on the ground that the item is on, which it must be standable. Like, is it possible that what I landed on was standable ground? If they just don't want you accessing it from above, so they put, like, a death, uh, uh, invisible death wall that makes it so that you can't, like, drop down? Damn it. Yeah, this guy has, like, the same moveset as the fucking katana version of soul, soul, uh, uh, look, uh, Soul of Cinder. The one that can buff himself with the red buff. And I think he's the one with the yellow buff as well that slowly heals him. I think it slowly heals him. Yes, okay. Let's have the guy climb up over the wall. 
Yes. Okay, uh, there's that. Um. Blood stain. I mean, fuck it. Okay, he came down. Okay, let me go get my blood stain before I do anything rash here. Maybe I was mistaken. Maybe there was no item down there. Maybe... I don't know. Well, let's just take this slowly but surely. We'll kill all these fucking enemies again. And we will figure this out like a rational adult. Okay. We'll go this way this time. Damn it. Damn it. I wish my stamina would recover a little bit faster while I'm shielding. Oh, I guess it's recovering decently fast. I can blast back their shields. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I've barely done that. But uh, it is good to know that it's possible by just, just hitting a guy over and over. We'll do it. Okay, so I do have to explore the rest of that area, assuming I don't find whatever's over here. So let's go get my blood stain, And then we will be far more... Oh God! Oh, 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 I thought I was dead. Okay, okay. I was worried that the imp behind me, oh God, had uh, aggroed, but he has not. Damn it. Fucking pile of fucking shit! Oh, I just gnashed heal. I sh guess I shouldn't fucking do that. I should just fucking dodge a fucking thousand times while the guy just never fucking runs out of stamina and just pressures me, pressures me, pressures me, pressures me. Never fucking gets staggered himself. Has way too much fucking health. What a fucking piece of shit that guy is. Fuck. It's five minutes of my fucking wa life wasted. Uh, fucking again. <sighs> well... Fuck going back for my fucking blood stain again. I'm just gonna fucking use my goddamn binoculars and fucking have a good look down there and see if there really was a fucking item down there or not. That fucking pisses me the fuck off that I just fucking lost to that fucking moronic enemy again. I'm about to lose to this fucking piece of shit. pisses me off that I can't figure out what the fuck to do here. Like, does it have to be just so obscure that you can only fucking find things by, like, random happenstance? Dude, this guy won't fucking lift his fucking shield. Or, like, attack or do anything. Fuck, hopefully... That fucking stupid bow and arrow guy comes down, because if he doesn't, it's going to make it pretty fucking annoying to try and explore this area. Okay, he does. Well... Oh. 
Like, what was I imagining the item? Maybe. Maybe I was just imagining it. I I'm gonna have to go back there and fight those fucking idiots and look from that angle to see if maybe it's somewhere that you can only see from there. Uh, let's just do this shit over and over again. Where's the imp? No fucking clue. Hopefully he doesn't come at me at an inopportune time. Yeah, so I have no way of, like, really being aggro over here. Holy shit, man. Oh my god. Dude, can't fucking lock on to fuck all. I mean, it's just random when you press your button whether you're gonna actually lock on to the guy or not. Even if you're facing straight fucking towards him. Sometimes you just don't get the fucking lock on privilege. Okay. Not close enough. Fuck. No. Fuck you. <sighs> Clearly here an enemy somewhere. Who fucking knows where? Like what's that white light through that little fucking... Who knows? Nothing, maybe. Okay, I'm dumb. That was not an item. That was just a fucking... Corpse laying next to... A torch, but... I mean, that guy down there... Is not nothing. That's gotta be... Oh, is that that one little room? Oh shit. Is that that one little room? That you have to fall off the ledge to get into? That's one of the shortcuts from like the chapel of the deep or whatever? Okay, let's uh... Let's go over here, check all this shit out. Fucking hopefully not get fucking destroyed by all these fucking enemies over here that there's shitloads of. Come on! Jeez! Tried to fucking change who I was locked on to. Can't do that. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm gonna fucking die a fucking again. Jesus fuck. Okay, let's carry on. More imps in here, right? Yes. What, when I run out, he drops down? I mean, I'm very certain that 
in a little room like this with nothing in it, I definitely would have fucking checked all the walls. Okay. Oh, that touched me, so now I can't heal. Alright, I checked up there, so... Let's just go back up here. There's three... tough enemies up here. Oh, fuck. Fuck you. Dude! Ugh. One more of them. Somewhere. Right? Or was it just two? I really thought it was three. them at once. Forgot about that. What is that green lighting? Oh yeah, I forgot about this little area out here. And that leads into the cathedral. Oh shit, tons of them. Yeah, what is with that green lighting on that statue? Oh, shit. Okay. It's just... It's just green. It's just green because it's green. see anything out here. Right, so this is the first place that I see the giant from. So we're back here at the scene of the fucking crime. How do I raise the third bridge? No idea. No idea. I don't see any switches. Uh. Hello. Hello. I don't think that those statues that barf on you have anything to do with anything other than they're just there to try and kill you. Yeah, I don't see 
see anything above me in this room or anywhere else. Shortcut. Where is your other switch brethren that I cannot locate? Why can't I locate it? missing what is with all these boxes here so since I lost all those fucking souls the only thing I've really gained from this area is that ring that allows me to do more damage at full health I mean that is potentially pretty useful depending on how much extra damage it gives me Okay, so I fully, like, basically chased down the Onion Knight. Like, since the fucking Onion Betrayer betrayed me, I have been everywhere in this place. Like, where, where else could he be? Assuming I'm even looking for him and not a switch. Like, like, uh, uh, I'm, I'm speechless. I'm, I'm flabbergasted. I'm aghast. I'm... At a loss. I'm befuddled. I'm I'm bewitched. I'm totally confused. I'm without an answer. Will this one climb up here? That one will. That's just a slime. I don't know. I, I don't know what else to say. I don't know what else to do. I'm 48 minutes into this video. So I have less than 12 minutes left to go. And after that, um, gonna be done for the night um, I guess we'll see if uh, anybody watches this and sees my plight and tries to give me some kind of hint on what the fuck I ought to do What are those items on the ground? There's just that guy's holy explosion bullshit or magical explosion bullshit. Yeah, I, I feel a little bit like a crazy person now. Just, just trying the same things I've already tried over and over. Is it here now? Is it here now? I know, I'll try it again. I know, I'll try it again. The same thing that I did already. Yeah. Yeah. That's... Fuck, I thought that was a new opening for a second. No, that just leads out into the big main room. Somebody else died, somehow? Uh, 
I don't see any ladders. I mean, fuck. Let's let's just roll into every wall like a fucking madman. I don't know. I don't know, y'all. I do not know what the fuck. Oh, it should be right here. It should be right over here. Just, just right over here somewhere. Where is it? It's here. It's right here. It's, it's here. Right here. This is it. it. Wait a minute. Oh, f I was like, oh my god, is that it? <laughs> nope. That's just another one of those weird looking fucking shiny statue things just like that that just makes me keep second guessing myself. God damn, that fucking freaked me out for a second there. I thought I actually found it. One. Two. Three. Four. Dude. Dude, I seriously thought I fucking had it there for a second. Holy shit, man. Uh, I don't in a million years think that anything will happen if I kill all those slimes again. I've already done it before. It takes forever. I'm not doing it again. If progress is locked behind killing all those slimes, then this game is just dumb as fuck. I don't think that's gonna do anything, though. I'll... I'll... I'll lower the fucking two bridges again. Which makes no fucking sense, because I had to fucking raise them. Again, already. Because fuckface lowered them. Why, why would the solution be go raise them both and then lower them both? Makes no fucking sense. Let's go do it anyway, though. It's right there. I just want up there. I just want up there so fucking bad. I wonder how frustrating this is to watch for somebody who, like, knows what the solution is. <laughs> I'm just wandering around aimlessly. Well, not totally aimlessly, but... Certainly in a state of desperation and potential futility. Yeah, I got a shield bash, too. Come on. Oh my god, hurry the fuck up. I could pull up my torch and do the shield splitter, I suppose. Nope. Nope, that's a torch attack. Thank you. I feel... Like a crazy person. Like may okay, may uh, maybe since he lowered the bridges, maybe somehow the solution revolves around having all the bridges lowered. This is so fucking dumb. Uh, this is so dumb. Poison. Uh, 
I... I'm out. I'm out of ideas. I'm at 56 minutes on this fucking video. Three, basically three hours I've spent wandering this fucking goo. Finding nothing. Except one ring. I mean, I'm glad I found the ring. Why can't I figure out? I just want to respect my character. Uh, I don't want to just fucking Google it. It's just gonna. Ugh. I like discovering things, and if this is the kind of game that just makes you fucking not able to fucking discover things as a reasonable person, you know, with basic exploratory and intellectual instincts, then why am I even playing it? Honestly. Why don't I just fucking throw it in the trash and write a fucking letter to the creator and tell them what a fucking shitty game they made. I mean, there's, there's just definitely nothing I can do. Except kill stupid fucking imps all day. I don't know. I don't know. That is going to be the end of this episode. Let me know what you think. Uh, if you would like to give me some kind of meaningful hint that would point me in the right direction, either towards the respecking room or to getting across that thing or to the onion guy quest, assuming those aren't all three the same thing, uh, definitely drop that comment. I would really appreciate that. Other than that, uh, I'll come back maybe tomorrow or the next day or the next day or whenever and uh, reassess my life's choices that led me to this place. That's the end of episode 93. Hope you're having a good day. Peace out.